Hello there and welcome, this is Shane Cook from Jasper Wellbeing and I'd like to guide you through one of my favourite calming, grounding exercises called calming of the heart. So what I'd like you to do is to sit down, find your comfortable space, it might be with your legs crossed, sat on a cushion, it might be with your back against the wall. could be on a yoga mat or simply on the floor on Mother Earth. What I would like you to do is to have a nice erect spine. Allow your body to relax by taking a few cleansing deep breaths. On your exhales just allow your body to melt into the earth and relax every muscle. Soften your face, your shoulders, your chest, your belly, legs, toes and fingers. And just relax further on every exhale, just breathing and just being. Notice your bottom connected to Mother Earth. And on the exhales, allow your body to sink into Mother Earth and perhaps merge together as one. After all, you are of this Earth. So what I'd like you to do is close your eyes now. And gently place your right hand on your heart. And with your left hand, bring together your thumb and first finger, touching tips. This is called the Gaya Mudra. It's a seal that helps us tap into our inner wisdom. When you touch your heart, you're opening up to love and compassion inside of yourself. Including everyone and everything around you. So just tuning into the beat of your heart, connecting to a feeling of compassion and allow space for everybody to receive your heart energy. Notice the speed of the heart. Is it slow or is it fast? Imagine that the heart is glowing green. Open to letting go and also open to receive. So now we will focus on the heart and the breath as one. What I'd like you to do in a moment is inhale nearly all the way in and hold for as long as is comfortable. And then exhale nice and controlled and slow, extended and long. You can exhale out of your nose or your mouth entirely up to you and as you inhale your belly is the first thing to expand along with the lower back then the ribs and upper chest upper back right up to the neck and when you exhale that's reversed and it goes from the top down So take a long deep breath in and leave a small bit of space at the top and then hold your breath for as long as feels comfortable. When you 
exhale, what I'd like you to do is to exhale slowly and controlled. And then when you're empty, when the lungs have emptied, then hold your breath again and hold your breath for as long as is comfortable on an empty lung. And as you do that, just know this isn't meant to hurt or be difficult. Just very softly holding and then gently letting go. Ready, do the same again. It's just flowing with ease. It's okay to think, by the way. If your mind is busy, try not to engage in the conversation with the thoughts and stories, as this will really take you out of your presence. And if that does happen, just Simply acknowledge it and allow the stories just to gently flow away. And then go again. You might notice that with every breath, that you can hold your breath for longer. Carrying on with that flow, you can inhale deeply, belly rises, leave a little space at the top and then hold your breath for as long as is comfortable. And then exhale fully and when you've emptied your lungs, again, hold the breath for as long as is comfortable. When your heart is calm, you can relax your hands again, just put them to the side and just be still in this empty spaciousness. Connect to that love that your heart radiates, that prana, joy, gratitude, bliss and strength. This recording is going to come to an end now, but you can carry on as long as you wish with those nourishing breaths, those holds, and those releases. Thank you, and enjoy your day. Namaste.